Hello everybody, welcome back to Police Simulator. Once again, we are checking out not only the new SUV that is part of the beta, but we are also checking out the new district. We've got Jefferson, Callahan Financial Sector, and Callahan here uh, all together. And we're going to do a evening patrol in the SUV. Let's get started. All right, look at that American flag right there. We just got done doing our Pledge of Allegiance. We're ready to get out there on patrol. Issuing parking tickets is what the bonus would be but we'll see how that goes i hope you guys had a fun safe fourth of july weekend as you can see i went to the beach got a lot of sun so that is the reason why it may look different i don't know if the camera's gonna pick it up as much but we'll see here it is right here this is the new police cruiser it's an suv same light bar same lighting setup basically not a whole lot you can um expect out of it besides the fact that it is a overall better police car than the crown vic it's faster it's got a better sound set to it although you know still needs a little bit of work but i'll show you it right now fire it up oh we got a robbery crime scene already we're gonna go ahead and accept that turn our lights on and siren not messing around already out of the gate we're gonna be responding to a robbery crime scene you can hear how crazy this thing sounds, this little SUV. The right turn here. There we go. Much faster. And here's the... Whoa, that door opened to scare the hell out of me. Here's the interior of this thing. And you can see it's modeled off of that SUV right there that we're passing. Pretty much. Clear those intersections. We're all good there. But yeah, that's the interior. Pretty nice looking. Not bad at all. Let's get back to it. Got to get through this intersection without dying. Woo, scary. We're good. <laughs> the right-hand turn here. But yeah, it's much quicker. It's got better braking. Sounds like it has a damn turbo in it, doesn't it? All right, we're going to be on scene here. And it looks like it's right over here on the left. I'm going to just flip around this way. We got a car just sitting... It's parked up on the sidewalk. No problem at all. I will be on location over. I've Here's a bunch of people right here. Scene. Nobody's hurt, so that's good. Uh, what's going on? Tell me what, what you, you see. Saw. I think I remember their hair color. Okay, well, that's good. That's a, that's a good start. We have that. Thank have a you. Have nice day. Goodbye. Thank you for the help. I'm sure somebody's going to be like, I even know the person. We're waiting for that. Can we you want tell that. Me what you saw? I'm pretty sure the person was black. Okay, well, there you go. Let go of that. Have a nice day. We're slowly piecing this together. I, I thought somebody would know them, but apparently not the case. Can you tell me what you saw? Yes, officer. There I it is. I the even person. know the person. That's all we needed. It's fine. That's Have all nice we needed day. there. Now we're going to continue on. They know the person. The area. I'm yeah. going to talk to them. The all right, we'll check Can it out in a second. Make sure this person's good to go. I know what the person was wearing. Okay, well, that helps. All right, sweet. You're good to go. You're Bye. good to go. Now we know she has a red dress. We're putting it, you know, piecing it together, doing our detective work as Tell we should have to. What'd you see? It was a woman. I'm sure about that. Okay. Well, yeah, we already knew that because the other person, I even know the person. We already knew. We already know the person. Okay. Well, you're good, you're to, good go, to go, dude. You're good to go. Bye. I love how that guy turns around and is like, okay, cool. Um, well, I think that's pretty much everybody. This is kind of, uh, yeah, we already talked to her. Um, okay. Well. She's got to be in this area somewhere looking for that red dress. Where's that red dress? That's her right up there, actually. That looks like her. Um, okay, we'll get to this car in just a second. We're going to go ahead and make contact with her and get my taser ready to go just in case. And we're going to point it at her. It looks looks like her. Um, actually, you know what? Let's not do it that way. Let's do it. Oh, there she goes. Now she's running. Never mind. I was going to try to do it the, you know, the easy way. But nope, she wants to run like an idiot. With her little phone. She got a little phone in her hand. Where are you going, dude? You're going to hit, get hit by a car. You know that, right? You know what? Nope. Police! Going to go ahead and tase her right here in the street. She she was about to cross out in there and probably get killed. But that was for her own safety, I suppose. Stay right there. Here we go. Remember, we have to do this. We have to be like, can you show me your ID, like please? Your ID, Thank you for sir. running from the police and getting tased. Here, but officer. can I see your ID so I don't get in trouble today? That would be nice. Isabella Morris. That's her. Uh, yeah, I'm sure she's avoiding eye contact. All right. Well, you know what? You're under arrest for a crime scene, and that was robbery. I have to arrest you for robbery. 
Please move to the sidewalk. Move to the sidewalk. What? Some people are very upset at the fact that they cuff in the front. Uh, maybe that's a thing from, you know, I don't know. I love how she just clipped right through the front end of that Crown Vic. Very cool. It's it's kind of, a, I guess, a Euro thing. I don't know. Okay, we're going to search her. Required. Is an officer available? Yeah, we will be um, available uh, here in a second. New information. We we're going to be checking for people left and right, but you get a lot of stuff for it. Car keys, handguns, stolen bag, stilettos. All right. Well, stiletto. Well, you're going to jail. Okay. Sorry. I need some backup here. Sorry Take about you. Into custody. We'll wait for them to get on scene we're and then we'll head off to, to find location. Josephine Gray in a gray suit. And we're waiting for that guy to get here. Let's go ahead and throw a parking ticket on this and get it towed out of the way. That would be ideal. There's the police transport right there. Fantastic. All right. Tow I've it up. A car here that needs towing. All right. Can they're here on scene. Record to my current location. What's up? How you doing today? She's right over here. Thank you for taking care of it. I got to get going to the next one. The next 24 hours. Next 24 hours. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We know. All right. We can't roll code three over that way. This we know. We just need to cross the street, actually. I was just making sure she's good to go, and she is. And we will be awesome. All right, so let's go ahead and turn around here. Didn't even have to use any, you know, MDT or anything like that. No need for it. We're going to take our time getting over here. We can actually use the cruise control so I don't get in trouble as much. All right, the person we're looking for should be up here on the left. In this little spot right here. Make our left turn here. Man, that thing just really revs up, doesn't it? Yeah, we're going to be looking for a gray suit lady with a little yellow thing in her hair. Okay. Just kind of roll through the area, see if we see anything. Maybe that's her right there. Hold on. Let me get out and check. I checked some. I, I did a stop and search on a person that looked just like her, and I got deducted points for it. Got to love that. Hey, what's up? You have glasses, and you don't have... Well, you look okay. She looks the same, just, you know, doesn't have glasses. All right, well, not going to mess around with that because I don't want to get, you know, more points deducted if we don't have to. I think this is her right here. I think we found her trying to be all sly. Uh, oh, she's fleeing. Of course she is. Dude, are you kidding me? Nope. Police, stop. <laughs> Already another one tased in the street because they ran from us. Nicely done, you dumb dumb. What's this about, huh? Let me see your ID your so I can ID, make sure please. it's you. It definitely looks like her. Yes, of it course. It does, officer. it does. Here you go. Now, I got docked some CP points because I found some pets that looked identical to her. And checking her ID and then letting them go didn't matter. I still got CP points deducted for it, unfortunately. Yep, this is our girl right here, Josephine Gray. And she's anxious. Well, the problem is you've got a warrant. I have to arrest you. Got a warrant there, a little girl. The and then the leg alone is going to poke me, stick me, harm me in any way. Please Let's find don't out. Do that. Well, it's happening. Sorry about it. Bring my car down. Well, actually, you know what? Let's go ahead and do this. Then we'll get transport and we'll bring our car down here. All right. Well, go ahead and search her up. Let's see if she has anything else illegal on her today. What we got? Anything? Uh, marijuana one ounce. They can have one ounce. Makeup, handgun, stiletto, and nail clipper. Oh, that's good. All right. Well, a call I need for some transport. Here. I'm going to go get my Take car. We're going to come right custody. down the road. Now, if you're wondering, she does not have a gun permit, so that's going to be another problem for her. She had a handgun on her, and she does not have a permit to do it. And transport is on scene. Let's go ahead and assist with them. Make sure it's all good to go. Got another one for you here. Yep, she was a little sly one. She was just hanging over there, just staring at, like that one, just staring at the glass. I couldn't see her face. How nice, right? Just a little bit. All right, there she goes, off to jail, and we'll be back 10-8. All right, I got a car just sitting. I have to take care of this. It's facing the wrong way, but on top of that, it's in a tow zone, so I don't know what they're thinking about this one here. So we're going to go ahead and say, hey, wrong direction. And we'll get it towed out of here because it's in the tow zone. And go to that. I've got a car here that needs towing. Can you yeah, send tow zone. No stopping any time between here. And it's parked. And sure, we'll probably get our little points for that one. I'd like to get a traffic stop going here. Well, certainly not one of our best shifts with all the CPE deductions. But that's all right. Hey, all right. 
We got Baytown unlocked. So Baytown only has a foot patrol. Let's go ahead and do it. Hey, report speeders with a radar gun is looking like the bonus is going to be that. So I'm not sure where a good spot to check for that is going to be. Maybe over here on this road, actually. So we'll run over this way and check it out. Right out of the gate, we got a car just, you know, parking right here on the sidewalk. No problem. They don't care at all in this town. Look at this pretty little deer right here. That's awesome looking. Gotta love the art they added into the game. And this is, you know, a very, very downtown area here we're at now. Parking ticket for you for being on the sidewalk. Another Crown Vic, another problem. You're facing the wrong way. So you get a ticket. Well, speed limit is 35 through here, so we're gonna see if we get anybody that even does one over. You know, I'm shooting radar over here. It would be nice if they made, you know, the speeders just a little more excessive than they are because, I mean, this is a 35 zone. And I'm not seeing anybody like even remotely speeding through here. Haven't had any luck with speeders, so we're gonna go ahead and just tow this car that's sitting here on I've the sidewalk as usual. Towing. Well, Baytown looks pretty darn cool. It looks like it's, it's under construction quite a bit compared to some of the other maps. But man, yeah, look at the tall buildings here. Very nice indeed. Ooh, were you going fast? No, not really. Okay. And a parking ticket for you for being on the sidewalk. Oh, you jaywalking idiot. I'm going to jaywalk to go get you. <laughs> oh, they're going to get hit by a car. Oh, my God, dude. What are you doing, lady? You jaywalking idiot. Stop. You are being detained for jaywalking. We know that is absolutely not acceptable in this town at all. I'm sorry. No, oh, you're sorry? Are you? Okay. Well, let's see your ID. Make sure you're not carrying a fake one. And then we Here can go. go from Officer. there. Miss, I want to jaywalk today. We got, okay, that's her, cool. Give it back to her, say, all right. You know what, she was nice. She said sorry, it's fine. we let Have her go. Nice Another one on the sidewalk, that's a no-no. Well, I've been there for a while trying to get some speeders. It's just not happening, man. No one's speeding today. A ticket and a tow is the price you'll pay. Can you yep, send a record to my get that record location. to our location, over. Thank you. Ooh, 36.5, finally, finally got one, man. You have to be like, you have to get them like one and a half mile an hour over the limit. Oh, damn, dude. Okay, that one's going faster. Now I think I found a decent spot here to catch them. They're going a lot quicker now. Ooh, that one was scooting a little bit there. That's all right. How about you? Uh, you're good. That one's fast. That one's fast. Got ya. 36.7. <laughs> I'm just trying to get my bonus points, you know, so I can level up and get that last part of this district unlocked. Gotcha. Out in the street a little bit here, aren't we? And no parking on a Monday. It's a Thursday, so they're lucky on that, but they are too far into the street. And we got a negative five for that, even though, I mean, clearly parked into the street. Whatever. This one's facing the wrong direction and in front of a fire hydrant. How dare you? I don't think so. Man, I'm ready for this shift to be over so we can finally get back into a police car. That's for certain. All right, and then you get one for being in front of a hydrant there, buddy. All right, the shift is finally over. Yay. We're all done for this one. Let's do Callahan Financial Sector in a car in the morning, and we're going to just focus on traffic stops. Welcome to the Callahan Financial District. Good luck getting into your police car because you can't. You have to actually move this one over before you can even get into the driver's door of the other one. So keep that in mind when you come down here to the Callahan business district here hopefully they'll fix that before too long but as of right now you do have to move this police car out of the way so you can get to your lovely suv right over chair so i'm behind a car right now i can always open up my police computer and then when we go over to the next tab you have a pacing car here here's your information on that subject and the vehicle information as well very cool you can just kind of simply jump in and out of that to check it look at all the cars that are just parked on the sidewalk down here it's it's kind of obnoxious. They need to like cut back on the amount of cars that are just parked on sidewalks. I mean, you just, look at this. We got one, two, three here on the right. And then we got four down here, five down here, six. Like it's, it's obnoxious. Oh man, we got an accident here. I'm gonna go ahead and just pull in and find out what happened. Maybe that's why we have some cars parked on the sidewalk over here just might be the issue let's go ahead and, and check it out all right sir what happened here My mind is blank is blank that's a classic 
All right, cool. Expired driver's license, and we are good on that right there, Mr. Ian Jackson. Give that information back to him. Definitely not going to be in uh, good with that one. So he's an expired driver's license. Expired ID there, bud, and I'm you're definitely getting you a ticket, ticket for it. Your expired ID. That should cost between seventy-five and one hundred fifty dollars. I don't have that much. You money. don't have that much money, dude. It's okay. Well, he sounds angry, but that's okay. I, the reason why he got a ticket was because it was from twenty nineteen. Like it was, it was pretty, pretty far. I tried to talk to her, but she doesn't want to talk to me. Oh, no, now she does. Okay. I'm still recovering from the crash. Okay, good. My mind is blank. When I first got on scene, I couldn't talk to her immediately. So, that's right. Let's get your ID. Whoa, camera. Vivian Walker. All right, Viv, you are good for now. 10 8. Yep, we're still good on that one. And 8 19 2020. That's coming up soon, but uh, not bad at all. I'll give her the information back. I'm going to see if I can interview some of these people here. Yep. Well, I didn't see anything because I wasn't looking. Okay. I'm just here because I'm curious. Oh, lovely. Thanks for adding to our report. We appreciate it. Have a nice day. Did you see anything, miss? I didn't see anything because I wasn't looking. Oh, here we go. I'm They're just, just curious. curious. All right, what did you no, see? I'm sorry. I didn't see anything. Didn't see anything. You're just here looking as well, right? I, as I assume that that's the case. You didn't see anything. You can you can go, It's fine. Have a nice it's day. It's fine. Have a nice day. All right, time to do some DUI tests. And let's just get this piece of junk out of here, too. We're just taking care of these cars that are on the park or on the sidewalk here. It's just, it's so obnoxious at this point. All right, DUI time. Well, test time. She's good to go there. All right, continue here. And we'll check out and see if she is drinking today. She has been drinking, but she's un she's under the legal limit. So it's okay for that. Um, not yet. Not yet. We're going to go ch check this guy out next. Clear on the drugs. No problem. Clear on alcohol. All right. Cool. Well, I'm not sure who is really at fault here. We don't really know. Let's take care of this piece of junk as well. Got to get pictures of the damage here. That's that's an important one. Okay. Nothing there. Oh, yep. Down here. Lots of, lots of damage there. What about the back of your car here? Yep. That's, that's pretty damaged. Report is extensive. Well, we're going to get it completely filled up here a damage right here on the back right and we have all this over here we're getting there we are definitely i know there's going to be a couple more maybe even possibly on this windshield no aha right here got it all right oh one right there oh almost had it there it is all right i filled up all or i got all the pictures now i wonder if this person saw something if i'm supposed to talk to them no, yep. I just saw the accident after they'd already crashed. Okay, I appreciate it, man. Thank you. Okay, there's got to be one more witness around here. One of these people that are up against the thing, maybe. Did you see anything, ma'am? Nope, nothing from you. Okay, cool. We're going to check this person over here. I don't think that's going to matter either. He's kind of just sitting here. Nope, he didn't see anything. Did you see anything, ma'am? Nope, not you. Okay, I think we've gotten everybody, which is strange. I can't fill that bar all the way up. It's all right. We've wasted too much time as it is. Okay. We're just going to go ahead and give Here's them an accident report, report and, and move on with their lives. She's been drinking a little bit, but she's not drunk, so she's not impaired. We'll say that. So she's going to be good to go in her vehicle. His is pretty destroyed. It's not going to be able to drive away. So you're good to go. You're good to go. Bye bye. Drive safe and have a nice day. All right, we'll go over to this guy and say, here you go, man. Here's your this accident report. Your accident but unfortunately, report. your Thanks, vehicle's going to get towed. So we're not going to search it or anything like that. We're just going to go ahead and tow his vehicle because it is not. I have a vehicle here no that good. needs towing. I need to wreck her at my current location, please. And he will walk away, and I can talk to him. Here you go. Sure, it'll be with you shortly. And you're good to go, dude. It's fine. Have a nice it's day. It's fine. Have a nice day. There we go. All right, we got our accident cleared. It wasn't the greatest thing in the world, but you know what? I don't know. We checked everybody around here, and who knows? Oh, somebody crashed again back there. Oh, we're not doing that. Nope. I've got a expired registration in front of us here. We're going to pull them over when it is convenient for us. Let's go ahead and light them up right here in the intersection and see where they end up going. They can find a good spot to park up here on the right. Should be after these two cars. And it looks like they're thinking about it, thinking about it, thinking about Come on, it's right there, dude. Just pull in. This is something they need to work on big time is giving these cars some better places to pull over when you try to do traffic stops. Because doing traffic stops right now is kind of difficult because of that only reason. I ignored a red light. I had my lights on. Oh, come on, people. Let's go. Just pull over already. 
This is like a slow speed pursuit at this point. There they go. There they go. All right. Whatever. Finally, we can conduct our traffic stop here with this car. We'll be out with this one. Let's see what's going on with them. Hi, ma'am. How you doing today? Reason for the stop is your car has expired license plate on it. Because your license plate is She expired. looks like she's wasted. Oh sure, my. Officer? I am sure. I am sure. You got your ID, ID and insurance? And if available. She looks like she's drunk. Please. I mean, look at those Here eyes. Go, officer. I'm telling you right now. I think she's wasted. What we got? We got 2023. Okay, so that one's good there. Ms. Sophie Kelly. And your policy is 2022. We're going to double check everything when we get back to the car. All right. Just sit tight for a second. I'll be right back with you, okay? All right, Sophie Kelly. She does not have a gun permit. And, yep, registration status is indeed invalid on the car. We already knew that, so that's good to go. Now, the problem is she is showing signs of impairment with her eyes. So I'm going to go ahead and have her step out I'd of the like vehicle. You to leave your car. Go to the side. And we're gonna do a DUI test on her because I I don't know I, I don't I don't think she's okay. Man, what is with these people crashing all over the place down here? And a car on the sidewalk. Look at her stance, dude. She's I think she's wasted. I think you're wasted, ma'am. We're about to find out. But I'm I'm saying you're a one seven eight. One seven eight. Come on. A one nine five. Even better. Situation that needs taking even higher. Anybody available? Nope, we're busy. busy. Thank you for those issue. stupid accidents. We good on that. All right, so the problem is, ma'am, you're going to be getting a violation today. That is for your car, not having uh, the correct registration on it. That Here's will be a ticket. ticket. Having an expired and the real display. surprise is coming right now, or she's going to get in trouble for $250. drinking and driving today. My lawyer will take care of it. Yeah, I'm sure they will. Well, they're going to have to take care of something else, too, because you're under arrest for DUI. I have to arrest you for driving under the influence of alcohol. There you go. What? Yep. And anything legal on you that's going to poke me, stick me, harm me in any way. Miss Kelly. And anything here? We got a letter, earphone, letter, a pocket knife. Okay. Well, two letters in uh, in that. Who wrote the note? Let's go over here and search the vehicle. Nothing in the car anywhere. So that thing's going to get towed. I have a vehicle here that there needs we go. towing. I and need a you're going to jail. Location, please. For being hammered, over, basically. Sure, I need some backup here. <laughs> my Take shift is over. Your shift is over, officer. Understood. We're sending the closest transport to your location. All right, wonderful. Thank you very much. Well, they're going to let me out. How nice of that van right there. And here's the people that got in their accident. We're coming all the way around this because we're going to let somebody else take care of that. This vehicle right here does not have proper registration. We're going to stop them. And ooh, I think they're actually going to do it. Oh, maybe not. And never mind. All right, I'll show you how fast this thing can actually go compared to the Crown Vic. It's actually pretty quick. Look at this. I don't care about the CP today. I really don't. I'm just trying to show you how fast this thing actually goes compared to the other one. And it's a lot more maneuverable. I mean, look at that. Woo, damn. Except for that. That's no good. All right, let's take this thing back to the police station. All right, guys, that's going to do it for this episode of Police Simulator. Let me know what you thought of it in the comments below, what you think of the new SUV and the new district of Baytown. And you have Jefferson, Callahan Financial Sector, and Callahan down there as well. Pretty darn cool stuff, man. Um, I'm, I'm liking having that. I, we still have this to unlock, so that'll be for another video. But that'll do it. I'll see you next time. Take care. I often get asked, Jeff, do you have any merch? And the answer is yes. You can check out the link in the description or you can just click right here on this video and it will take you to the merch store. Thank you so much for all the love and support. I do appreciate it, guys.